drive home the point that Africa has significant fragilities that make us particularly vulnerable to the effects of global disruptions such as the pandemic we're just coming out of. We're always going to be the hardest hit by a phenomenon of that magnitude. The COVID-19 pandemic was therefore a most unwelcome and unpleasant eventuality that impacted the continent severely. Data from the Economic Commission of Africa, ECA, shows that COVID-19 created the continent's worst recession in 50 years, with real GDP shrinking by 3% in, averagely by 3% in 2020. Before the pandemic, poverty reduction was already a major challenge. The pandemic is estimated to have dragged about 55 million more people into poverty in Africa and exposed another 46 million more to the risk of hunger and malnourishment. Indeed, 70% of hunger in Africa, which had already been on the rise since 2014, is directly attributable to this pandemic. Like governments all over the world, it became necessary for African governments to take action to shield their populations from the effects of the epidemic. This meant in many cases an increase in deficits due to unbudgeted expenditures. This has devastated many African 